We went to an antique shop yesterday. I'm gonna show you a little bit of footage from that and a little haul of what I got in my Christmas tree. Diet Coke, anyone? I didn't know what this guy was, but I thought he was really snazzy um, until I flipped him over. He's a shot glass and I am disappointed I didn't grab him. This is a booth of jewelry. I found some really good pieces last time from and I was just checking out everything. Now I'm feeding Gigi, so if you hear that, that's what that is. I thought this pin was so pretty. I did not get her, I put her back, but I thought she was adorable. Another thing about this booth is it was half off no 30 percent off and some of it was half off if it had a red slash through the tag this bin is kind of a cluster but it's fun to look through it's where i found most of the jewelry that i got last time i think i got a couple pieces from here i thought this little guy was handy dandy but i put him back too he's cute there these are some earrings my mom found digging through. So I grabbed those. They are likely lucite and they glow. She grabbed these beads, but she didn't end up getting them. And they were 55 cents. This was a booth of a bunch of kind of figurines and such. We liked that little Irish girl, but it was a music box. I don't really do music boxes um, personally or selling, but she was cute. We did not get her. Some glass. This, is, this was going to be a buy, but it had a crack. I thought she was cute too. Not in great shape though. We passed on her. And here is that custard bowl from 1898. It glows. Six bucks. I grabbed it. And this is the last of the footage. It was hard to get uh, footage everywhere just because there were a lot of people and lots of vendors here today. We just got home from the antique mall and I'm going to show you what we ended up getting. The first um, thing that I found was this pair of Oh my gosh, wait, where's the camera? Oh, was this pair of earrings and can you even see that on camera? Not really. They glow. They kind of look like boobs. They glow. Um, I got them for 55 cents. The next thing I found, I was actually talking about it on the way to the antique shop in the car. So whenever I spotted this, I had to grab it, obviously. It was 10 bucks. This orange fridge dish. My kitchen is green, and I'm trying to go with green, orange, and yellow, and this is gonna look awesome in there. This next thing I got was a, um, well, is a Victorian sort of just trinket dish. It's custard glass, and it also glows. Look at that. There we go. This next thing I'm unwrapping is so cute and it was only a dollar. It was this Odagari sort of, oh, is it a creamer? Or a, a sugar or a creamer? It's one of those two, cause it doesn't have a spout, but it has a little, I think it's a sugar. Like this is where it would come out or a spoon would go. And it's perfect for Christmas. This place always has good stuff. If you're local to me and wanna go thrifting, um, definitely let me know because we can go. I like to go at least three times a week just so I can build up a good supply of items. I would go every day if I could, but this next thing I might keep for me it's this 20s Jeanette glass ashtray, and it's a floral sunflower design on the back. 
the grand total at this place was $227.55, by the way. And we got everything that I'm showing you. This is a Fenton vase. That bottom part glows orange, if you can see. And I think the top might also. It's hard to really show you on camera. This vase is my favorite. I love it so much. This one we got for 28. Um, yes, it does glow. Lots of glowing goods today. I have three more vases that I got. This one we got for 12. It also glows. Can you see? Yep. Woo! This is another Fenton piece. What was this? 12. $12 we got this one for. 10. 10. Are you sure? This thing, this is a little salt dip. He gave us for free. And it's uranium glass. Wow. Lights, camera, action. That's like, yeah. Wow. My mom got this one. It's like a Cinderella blue type. It's cute. She's cute. We got, you don't want to be in it. <laughs> we got a Fenton alley cat for a hundred bucks. Let me grab her. She's heavy. She's opalescent. She's also cute. It looks like oil spill. This is what that looks like. And I almost bought you one of these like a month ago. Yeah, it looks like an oil spill. And she's cute. It is like a foot tall. It's heavy. Ugh. Uh huh. Love it. It has its original sticker. I got this. Where's the camera? Hello? Oh. Yeah, it's not focusing, but this is, um, shit, what is this called? Tiger, tiger's eye? Can't see it, but it's tiger's eye. And then this is just some sort of gemstone. <sighs> um, she got a couple rings and a little mouse pin that big. And last but not least, I got this guy. This little jadeite Scotty dog. Super cute. All of that for two, I always forget, two twenty seven fifty five. So let's do an overview of everything. Thanks for watching our haul, Gigi says, right? Thanks for watching my haul and all of these items will be up, well, most of these items will be up for sale soon and stay tuned for what's next, right, Gigi? Bye.